My, my Lords, following on from the loss and damage question, the Labor Lady, the Minister, uh, said it's really important there's discussion. Uh, well, isn't we, haven't we utterly arrived at the time when we need action, given the fact that loss and damage was kicked into the long grass, taken out of the Glasgow Climate Pact and put into the Glasgow Dialogue instead? Uh, now, Denmark has promised loss and damage money. Scotland has promised loss and damage money. Belgium has uh, the Belgium region of Wallonia has promised loss and damage money. If the government wants to be world leading, where are we going from discussion to actual action and a promise of money? And it's not the same thing as adaptation finance. <laughs> In my experience, you could only get action, especially in an international context, if you have constructive discussion. And in terms of our contribution, the UK spent 2.4 billion of our international climate, climate finance between 2016 and 2020 on adaptation and investment in areas needed to address loss and damage. The Scottish Government Fund is 2 million. 